Okay, gonna do a quick look at the build here before I do the run. All right, I've got Hunter's Fury with uh, weapon damage, critical damage, and a critical chance mod. Uh, the chest, I'm using Sokolov Concerns. Probably not the best chest piece, but it increases my SMG damage. And I've got weapon damage, weapon handling, which I hate. Uh, critical hit damage and a critical hit damage mod. Uh, holster, I've got Hunter's Fury, and I've switched this to armor. With, uh, so it's got critical limit damage as well. Backpack, I'm running Memento with a critical hit chance mod. Glove is in our Hunter's Fury that's been switched to armor uh, with critical hit damage for the attribute. And the knee pads, Hunter's Fury armor with critical hit damage. Then, of course, I'm running Gunner so I never have to get ammunition. And then I'm using Lady Death as my primary weapon, partially because. It shoots fast, it does decent damage, and you can, as long as you keep moving, it increases your uh, overall damage. So, since you just kind of keep on moving, it, it always builds this up, and then after you kill someone, you get movement speed boost, which helps get through these spaces quickly. All right, and my watch. Uh, as you can see, the big ones are really going to be to have your damage as high as you can. Uh, this side is whatever you want. I did um, explosive and then this first. Uh, down here I did reload first obviously and over here was skill damage. And that's pretty much it. So, oh yes, and of course I'm using the Banshee Pulse and the Assault Drone.